What up, everybody? It's time for the last eBay break of the night. We're going to be doing 2017-18 Contenders Basketball Half Case Break number two. Let's make it do what it do. Now, if for some reason you don't like half casers, check out uh, RipCityCards.com. We're doing full casers. As a matter of fact, I got nine teams left in Contenders Basketball. I got the Cavs, Clippers, Grizzlies, Nets, Nuggets, Pacers, Pistons, the Blazers, and the Wizards. Uh, still available. Uh, in the meantime, let's go ahead and open this up for eBay. Uh, so, Jersey, my suggestion, dude, out of the remaining teams, I would say the Nuggets, man. The Nuggets have a decent autographs, and they also have Carmelo Anthony. There's the half caser. Uh, let's put this over here. Half case mojo. Right, right. Good luck, everybody. All right, he's tired. He's tired. Let's do this thing. Matter of fact, I'm going to put you to work, dog. Heat up these boxes. All right, everybody. I wish you the best of luck. Let's see what we got. So once case number four is filled, I got another case to put in the store. I got cases upon cases, baby. Yo, what is it? What's the formal pronunciation of Tupac? What is it? Usted Pac. Mmm. That's pretty fucking good. Who told you that one? I just saw that shit on Facebook. That's like a dad joke or something. That <laughs> That's is, fucking awesome. That is pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm going to use that shit. Uh, this is eBay break, Hyper G. This is a half caser, man. Uh, Yves, if you want to take the Cavs, man, take them out of the store, dude. They're still in the store. They are still in the store. From what I can tell, we have nine teams left on the uh, case number four. Yep, nine teams left. Oh, Jonathan Tong. Well, listen, I go by the screen names. So, yeah. Can't come in. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. There's a method to the madness, man. All right. Uh, CJ McCollum of the Blazers Refractor. We, we won't let Pokemon get away that easy. <laughs> uh... Now that that dude's busy, man. He he came in to tell me a joke, which is pretty good. Uh, but that dude, that guy's fucking bombarded with sorts, man. So two forty nine, Stephen Adams of the Thunder. And you know what? It's I'm gonna take the all the blame for that. I've been breaking too much lately. I've been breaking too much lately. Oh, look at that! A Kyle Kuzma to seventy five for the Lakers on card. Rookie auto. That is nice. That is nice. I wonder what they paid for it for it in a half caser. It, did you finally get the code to work, uh, Jersey Devils? Front row seat for the Cavs. Kevin Love. I, it's not even that can't go main. I just don't want to do it to be honest with you. I, I I don't. I am not a fan of pack stacking. I'd rather go box by box, make sweet love to them. Jonathan Isaac of the Magic with the draft lottery ticket. You want to hear him read autographs? Yo, I tried to get him to do a break last night, and he was like, no. Nah. And we don't we don't need that kind of mojo. You know what I'm saying? We we need we need confidence in the mojo. Like, fuck yeah, I got that shit. I'll do that shit. Let's do it. 
if you really want to hear him uh, read read names, I'm gonna have him do a hockey break. <laughs> that's that that's hilarity right there. Rah rah. Speaking of days off, I have tomorrow off and 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 Saturday. CBJ is gonna be in here, so you guys get to bombard him with uh, with questions on the baby. Uh, Goran Dragic of the Heat with a refractor. Dude, Mario's a pimp. Mario is a fucking pimp. To 249, LaMarcus Aldridge of the Spurs. What do we have here? It's for the Grizzlies. Ivan Rab to 75. Someone else picked up the Cavs, Ives? Well, that sucks. You got to be fast on that trigger, man. Next time, don't say you're going to pick up the Cavaliers. Because then somebody's going to be like, oh, shit, someone's buying the Cavaliers? That must mean they're good. Shit, let me buy them. See? And then Kanko Man told you, don't, don't talk about it, baby. Be about it. There you go, Kanko Man. You let him know. Put your balls on the table, damn it. All right, the Cavaliers are indeed gone. So we are down to eight teams. We got the Clippers, the Grizzlies, the Nets, Nuggets, Pacers, Pistons, Blazers, and the Wizards. And once that is full, I'm going to throw another case in the store. You damn skippy. And people, if you want to get into full case breaks, visit RipCityCards.com. I'm about to do a full case break of contenders at RipCityCards.com. Well, uh, Final Flash. Yo, Final Flash! Vegeta Sama! It was kind of sad he just got eliminated in the tournament. Uh, do you watch Dragon Ball Super? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, the Wizards, I'm not going to lie to you. The checklist is not good for the Wizards. They don't have a single autograph. Uh, but they do have parallels. They do have parallels. Uh, but Final Flash, this is an eBay break. This is Contenders number two. Oh, I got you, Ives. I see what you did there. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> Well, Final Flash, get comfortable, baby. And how do you not know for sure? Like, can't you check your eBay stuff and like, oh, okay, that's what I bought. Jordan Clarkson of the Lakers uh, refractor deal. I even told Jason, I was like, yo, I might not even leave you a case to play with. And he's like, that's fine. DeMar DeRozan to 249 for the Raptors. Not a single auto has come out of here yet, but there is a redemption. I can see it. There it is. That's an auto, and it could be a big one. Could be a big one. Kyle Kuzma has redemptions. Donovan Mitchell has redemptions. Kuzma has redemptions. It's craziness. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you, Final Flash. I fucking feel you. Front row seat onto the Kumpo for the Bucks. And those front row seat cards are pretty sweet. I ain't gonna lie. These two. Rookie of the year, contender. And I don't I don't even think he should be in consideration. Ben Simmons. Because he's not a rookie. Is that literally what that means, Kanko Main? Uh, you know, whatever you say, I take it as, as, as the truth. Scotty. For the Jazz, Rodney Hood. Refractor deal. So, Redemption, there's uh, players who didn't fulfill their contract and sign. And didn't sign yet. Damn. That's not good. So 99, D. Howard of the Hornets.
the other auto. Boom! For the Magic Jonathan Isaac. 5 out of 75 with the Judah auto. Uh, need more top loaders. Luckily, I keep some on deck. Wow, Kanko, man. That's, that's, damn. That's some hobby shit right there. I did not know that. I figured, oh, they, you know, they just didn't, they never got, they never got around to printing it out in time. So, you know what I mean? Redemption for Tony Bradley. Rookie variation playoff ticket. Uh, Tony Bradley is Donovan Mitchell's teammate, if I'm not mistaken. That goes to the Jazz. Damn, Tony. We want Donovan, bro. Which, by the way, that was one of the crappiest dunk contests I ever seen in my life. That shit was terrible. And my boy had the best dunk of the night. Donovan, uh, not Donovan. Dennis Smith Jr. had the sickest dunk of the night. My man, uh, he did like a 360 through the leg tomahawk dunk. And he made it look easy. But, you know, he fucked up. He, he, he couldn't put his first dunk through. So there's that. And Donovan Mitchell, I don't know, man. I feel like he could have been a lot more creative with his dunks. Right, Kanko, man? Uh, Hyper G, I got this box and three more. Ooh, Joshua, that's actually not a dumb question. That's all a matter of opinion, my dude. That's all a matter of opinion. I, it, however, I think the consensus is Donovan Mitchell. I think we've all come to an agreement that, uh, that Donovan Mitchell is probably the best rookie right now. Uh, but again, it's all a matter of opinion. If you're a Chicago Bulls fan, you're going to say Laurie Markkinen. If you're a Heat fan, you're going to say Bam Adebayo. If you're a Mavericks fan, you're going to say Dennis Smith Jr. If you're a Laker fan, you're going to say Kyle Kuzma. Or maybe Lonzo Ball. You know what I mean? If you're a Suns fan, Josh Jackson. If you're a Celtics fan, Jason Tatum. So, it's, there's a lot of good rookies this year. A lot of good rookies. What else we got here? Box number three. Klay Thompson of the Warriors with a refractor. It is it is crazy how deep it is. Seriously, can't go man. Like literally every team has a solid, and I'm talking like getting minutes, solid rookie in the league. Like every team has a good rookie this year. Like it's really insane. It really is. But dude, that's it's awesome for the hobby. It's awesome for the hobby. To so 249, Mike Conley of the Grizzlies. Yeah, agreed. Kuzma superstar. Well, I think he's close to reaching the ceiling, but he could be a superstar. Dennis, Dennis Smith Jr. is going to be a fucking superstar. Uh, Donovan, MVP caliber. Marking it can be a superstar too. And there's a lot of players that we still haven't seen, like Harry Giles. You know, he got injured in college, but before, before he got hurt, you know, he was a lottery pick. He could come out like gangbusters. De'Aaron Fox is another dude that I haven't even mentioned. And he's he's he has disgusting potential. Justin Patton, who knows? This kid might turn things around and be a baller, you know? Uh, to 35 is the Justin Patton, by the way, for the T-Wolves. And you know, th this product is a little funny, too, because they have the historic uh, rookie throwbacks. Uh... You know, there's Kobe Bryant autos in this, D. Wade, Anthony Davis, Chris Paul. It's kind of kind of nuts. This product is crazy. I'm with you, Kanko Man. I'm with you, man. It's 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 literally every team has a good rookie, man. Lakers got three. Josh Hart is nice. That dude got buckets. Kuzma is like damn near a complete player coming out of college. And Lonzo Ball has Potential through the roof. Yeah, we don't need these, do we? Nah. 
Rookie of the Year for Justin Jackson of the Kings. The Rookie of the Year contender card. But, dude, yeah. This is a very, very good class. Very good class. You know, in like in like 10 years from now, we're probably going to look back and be like, damn, there was the 97 draft with Kobe and them, AI. There was the 03 draft with Melo and D-Wade and LeBron. And the 17 draft might be up there in that conversation. Uh, so that Aldridge, I'm sorry, Kawhi Leonard of the Spurs front row seat. Who might be coming to the Heat? Might be coming to the Heat. I just I just want everybody to play for the Heat, honestly. Alright, we hit the patent. We need one more autograph. And another kid that no one's even talking about. Markel Foltz, the number one overall pick. That kid could be yo, what if he does what if he pulls a Ben Simmons, Joel Embiid? Sits out an entire season, comes back and fucking murders it. You know what I mean? Another thing to consider is this is basketball, dudes. These these are like one and done players in college, so they're coming into the league. They can't even buy beer. They're nineteen, twenty years old, man. Uh, Wicked liquids. Sorry, dude. I don't really pay much attention to the to the breaker chat, uh, but this is uh, eBay number two. Contenders eBay number two. Wicked Liquids. Dude, Kanko Man, don't sleep on Foltz, man. He he might be uh, catfishing everybody right now. To 99, Ben Simmons of the Sixers. Sorry, Wicked Liquids. Took me forever to get to you, man. And here's a marketing to 125 for the Bulls. I've seen those videos of uh, Markel Foltz shooting around and stuff. But uh, I'm going to claim that's fake news. I'm going to say that is fake news. Sixers are just trolling the entire league right now. There's a reason he was the number one pick. There is a reason that kid was the number one pick overall. Gotta trust the process. Gotta trust the process. Yeah, dude, Kanko, man, I, I agree with, with Lonzo, dude. The, the guy has vision, ridiculous, and he, you know, he, he has deceptive athletic ability. You know, he has, like, he's kind of, he's like, he kind of reminds me a little bit of Jason Kidd, but not really. I, I feel like Lonzo's maybe less flashy, a little bit more fundamentally sound. Um, but dude, a jumper, he, he can get a jumper, man. These kids are 19, 20 years old. You know what I mean? Playing against grown ass men. A summer or two, put in that work, you could, you could develop a jumper. But you know, the intangibles, that's something you can't develop. You know, the, the court vision, the IQ, things like that. Athleticism, you know, you know, you know, there's a saying in basketball, you can't teach seven feet tall. So, you know, you got to watch out for Fultz. I think Fultz is going to be nice. I really do. I really do. Whenever he does play. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, keep it moving with box four here. Got Jimmy Butler to 249 for the T-Wolves. Are you serious, bro? Markel Fultz is using virtual reality to get a shot back? You got to be, bro. Yo, either the Sixers are doing, like, the most ultimate troll job right now, or that kid is in, like, he seriously has, like, some issues. There you go, Kyler. Uh, Boogie Cousins with the front row seat for the Pelicans. Hey, Kankleman, are you going to the game tomorrow? My my boys are in your city right now. The Heatles are in are in are in Nolans. Any chance you're going to the game tomorrow, bro? Ex Yo, I was gonna say, uh, uh, I was gonna bring that up actually, but yeah, I seen an interview uh, for Ben Simmons, and it was actually on ESPN, uh, and you know they were t it was like it, it was leading up to the to the All Star game or whatever. You know you know how they do like. 
their their media shit leading up to the All Star game. And uh, yeah, same thing, same same question. Uh, somebody came out and was like, "So, do you have confidence in Markel Fultz getting his jump shot back or whatever?" And then Ben Simmons gives like the lady a look, like, "Bitch, really?" And then he's like, "I hate same thing like you said. I hate guarding Markel Fultz in practice." Because he's too quick, too fast, he's shifty, and he's 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 a little crafty, man. He's a little crafty. Alfred Payne of the Magic with the refractor deal. And people forgot that kid got buckets in college. That kid got buckets. So he might not be able to shoot, but what are you gonna do if you can't stop him from getting into the rim? You know what I'm saying? Put Markel Fultz and Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid in a pick and roll situation. What are you going to do? Ersan Ilyasova. Hawks refractor. We do need another autograph. I have a uh, redemption in there. In my opinion, Hyper G. Whoa. What is this? A gold Ben Simmons for the Sixers. What is that, the 10? 10 out of 10 at that, people. That's nice. That is nice. Were they really, Kanko Man? Damn, you should have got me uh, should have got me a, an autograph, dog. So I'm assuming you're going to go to the game tomorrow, all right? Give me an auto, bro. Give me a D-weight auto. Tyler Lydon to 125 for the Nuggets is the autograph. The Redemption is still down there chilling. Gambling and boozing just like the Heatles do, baby. All right, the Redemption. Wow. Damn. The historic rookie season ticket for Giannis ante the kumpo that is nice in case you didn't know the bucks do have giannis autographs and that's one of them that is sick that is sick cancel main it's waiting on you dog is waiting on you dog Kinko Man, I got you with that 101, bro, bro. Well, I seen some other dude said he had the books. So either he's behind in the stream, like Final Flash, somebody got the whatever. I think there's a little confusion going on here. Who got the books in this break? This is contenders number two for eBay. Oh, the Simmons. Okay, the Simmons. Okay, so he's behind. He's behind. There you go, Final Flash. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Cavaliers are gone. Clippers are gone. Nuggets are gone. The Blazers are gone. The Grizzlies are gone. And the Pistons are gone. We got three teams left in number four, people. We got the Nets, the Pacers, and the Wizards left in number four. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, Yves, LeBron James autographs are exclusive to Upper Deck. Same thing with Ben Simmons. Oh, good job. Good job with the troll. Yeah, I know, Tyler. What what threw me off was, you know, it's because he he's he's behind in the stream. He's behind in the stream. I mean, I'm talking about Final Flash. So that that's why it threw me off. He was talking about the Ben Simmons gold, but I was on the Giannis. So I was like, wait a minute, what? Play a fuck up. Play a fuck up. All right. Let's fuck up this box here. Where the hotness at?
There we go. To 249, Rajon Rondo, Pelicans. And damn, that's a nice card. 9 out of 25, John Starks of the Knicks. That's dope. That is dope. Didn't this dude dunk on Jordan? Back in the day, day? Or maybe it was Scotty. I don't know. That's still nice. Malik Monk of the Hornets with the Rookie of the Year Contender card. Gotcha, Kyler. Scotty. What do we got? We have Marcin Gortat to 99 for the Wizards. A little plate. That's my second plate. Oh, damn. For the Spurs, Derek White. On card, pl well, on plate auto. Yellow plate. 101 for the Spurs. Nice. He did dunk on Jordan, right? That's what I thought. Giannis, front row seat for the Bucks. Larry Legend. All right, we should get another autograph out of here. Who's it going to be? For the Heat, Hassan Whiteside, the Refractor. We got TJ Warren of the Suns Refractor. What the fuck? Am I tripping? It was probably the John Starks. Hold on. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, it was the John Starks, so we're not missing an auto. Thought I was tripping, bruh. Put this away. And now, you know it. It's the last box mojo. Got three teams left in number four, people. We got the Nets, Pacers, and the Wizards. And then we're ripping full case number four in the store. Last box mojo. Good luck, everybody. Let's see what we got here. Cracked ice for LeBron James. 16 out of 25, the most valuable contender. Insert. Giannis, refractor for the books. Dame Dollar to 249 for the Blazers. Nice. 
there. That's what we got here. Andre Drummond of the Pistons Refractor. Shaquille O'Neal. He actually has autographs in this for the Magic, though. To 99, LeBron James for the Cavaliers. What is that? Got a little Celtic green. Jason Tatum. 13 out of 75 for the Celtics. Damn, this is a pretty good case. Well, half a case, I should say. That is nice for the Lakers. I mean, uh, Celtics. I'm tripping, I'm tripping. All right, we got a last auto, and there it is. Mario Hazonja to 199 for the Magic to finish things off. What else we got? So you get a little 101 parallel, maybe. Those are Superstar. Die cut for Clay Thompson Warriors. Oh, Arsen, man, you got to be positive, dude. Have positive thoughts. Do that next time and watch the hits come pouring in. You got to stay positive, baby. You know, the, the universe listens to all that picks up on those vibes and that was the break people so uh, let's go ahead and recap it let me do something here first mm -hmm. all right so we have a gold Ben Simmons 10 out of 10 that's pretty sweet for the Sixers. His own jet to 189. Magic. A Derek White plate auto for the Spurs. 101. Yellow plate. Uh, Tyler Lydon to 125 for the Nuggets. Justin Patton to 35. Timberwolves. Tony Bradley of the Jazz. Redemption. Jonathan Isaac of the Magic to 75. Ivan Rabb to 75. Grizzlies. To 25, John Starks of the Knicks. A Giannis rookie season ticket redemption for the Bucks. Laurie Market into 125 for the Bulls. A Kyle Kuzma to 75 for the Lakers. And a Jason Tatum to 75 for the Celtics. Not a bad half case eBay. See? Good things come to those who wait. And that was the break, peeps. Thank you very much. 2017-18 Contenders Basketball Half Case Break Number 2, eBay Style. Thank you very much, peeps. We'll get that out to you.